Hey YouTube, this is Forever Day Rock, and I'm sorry if you hear my air conditioning. Kind of just decided to turn on, like literally the second I started recording. So screw your air condition, and hopefully no one else can hear it in this video. Anyways, thank you guys for tuning in. This is gonna be another episode of our Clash Clans. It was originally gonna be a let's play, and then I remembered, crap, we have a clan war soon, and I kind of need to record. So, I need to record the previous clan war, so that's exactly what I'm going to do right now. I just want to say hello to everyone who has been joining the clan recently, like, for example, Lucy, right? I think that's pronounced Lucy. I believe that's how it's pronounced. If I'm wrong, correct me on that. Um, person just joined, so nice to meet you. I just said hey, because, yeah. And I uh, also want to say welcome to Big Boz on your jaws, Lou, Brian... And, uh, yeah. So, all those people joined within the last couple days, so thank you guys. Um, so far you've been pretty awesome, and, uh, I hope I get to chat with you guys later. Anyways, so, uh, today, we were just, as I said, we are gonna do the, um, the clan war recap. So let's go that. We did win it. So, yay us. Uh, we won by one. And I don't know what was the uh, deciding one, but let's see. Ah, uh, must have been Brian right here getting the uh, three star, three star on white, whitey hashtag whitey thirty six. All right, let's um show my attacks right here. Now, mind you, I failed on the first one. All right, this one was my bad. This is what not to do. Um, cause here was my problem. One, I took way too much time taking out those guys, and I had a tough time doing so. But my main problem was this air defense right here. I could not get rid of it. Could not get rid of it. Alright, I'm gonna speed it up. Yeah, get rid yeah, archers, bam, get rid of them. They were level 5 giants, as you can tell by the gold. Oh yeah, here comes mine. Alright, so my giants get in there. They weren't enough to take it out, which sucked a lot. And I had a wizard in my clan castle, and it kind of died immediately. So it was really bad. But, I got rid of it. Um, I didn't, I, because I have such a low troop capacity, I just didn't have enough balloons to win it. It's, yeah, I was screwed on that one. But on my second try, actually against a higher level, uh, a higher level base, I ended up getting a 3 star, yeah. I believe it was higher compared to the other. Yeah, it was. And this one was fairly good. This one was fairly good. Yeah, as you can see, I drew out the clan troops as you're supposed to. You always want to draw out the clan troops. You never want to forget that. That is so important. I'm sorry if you heard that. I have been drinking iced tea like no tomorrow. It's so good. Right, so yeah, once I had gotten rid of the air defense, I just dropped in my balloons in the most strategic of places that I could think of to do, well, just this very thing as you're watching right here and go ham. I also had a balloon in my clan castle, so thank you for donating me that, you clan. The clanmates I have are the best, honestly. I had, I had two of them in there. Yeah. I think they were level 5 or level 4s or something, I don't even know. But they were fantastic, and they were the reason I was able to win this raid right here. They, they, it came down to the last possible second. So, thank you guys. That, they were fantastic, and they were a big help. Um, we'll watch one of the defenses on mine. Uh, Dungeon Queen, 42% on me. I'm using, I think, close to the same base. Just about. Yeah, I had... Okay, our clan, like, almost always donates wizards into the war castles. Just saying. So, uh, yeah. They are such a huge help. I think I had two of them. Or th yeah, two wizards, three wizards, I don't know. Oh, three wizards in there. Jesus. And they kind of they kind of do work, if you can't tell. And no one's... Uh, I was going to say they're trying to come through the side now. See, this base is... is to be honest, fairly effective. I mean, there's a reason I used it. That I, I'm using this base. Because it does work. It, at least it does work for me. I know some people um, actually said, like, oh, you should move around the mortar and the wizard tower. And I'm like, eh, you know. 
I, I made it, it's the way I like it, I'm gonna keep it that way. Um, you, like, it's not the best base, because as you could see, I got a uh, 40%, and I do get 100%ed here, but, again, you know, it was fairly good. It protect it didn't get the guy the one star, that's all that matters. Yeah, here comes my clan castle. Uh, this guy's troops had to be much higher leveled, because he, yeah, he took care of me no problem. So, um, I don't really know what level they were, but, uh... He, okay, he also had two dragons, so he was much higher leveled, and did rage spell. So, okay, yes, this base does not defend against dragons, I'm sorry. Uh, especially two or more. Uh, you're kind of going to get screwed, especially once he gets rid of the air defense, it's done. There's nothing left of that. Anyways. That was... <laughs> that was a very good one. Well, let's see any other battles that look maybe interesting. And then... Ooh, I got a two star and I got a three star. Um, let's check out this one. This one was probably good. Did I bar? Oh, I think I remember. Yeah. All right. So watch this. I think I did fairly well on this one. Again, I'm gonna speed this one up because I speed them all up. I don't want to bore you with it. I think I did fairly good on this attack though. So I actually barched this one. I, I used barcher. If you don't know what barcher is, uh, look it up. Or check out one of my previous videos. I did end up doing a video on it. Now, <laughs> to be honest, I don't know how I got the this two star. I got lucky as hell right here. Um, see, here's what I noticed. I just noticed that all of them broke in right there. And I was about to give up once I hit 50%. But once I saw that they started to break in, I'm like, okay, I gotta drop the rest in. So I'm like, bam, right there. And then Barb King going in. And going ham. Thank you, Barb King, for getting me up to 84%. Give me the two star to help my clan win. We won because of one star. And if I did not, if I did not uh, do that one right there, we wouldn't have won. We would have got a tie. Um, and we'll just do this last one right here. So this one I did balloons, I believe. See, because this is a slightly underleveled base, and I got my level five giants. Because you can see by their gold uh, fists right there, it means they're level five. And, uh, yeah, you had a dragon in the clan castle. Bastard. Again, this was a great one, though. Um, because once I got the, once I got the giants in to get rid of those, uh, defenses, it was all over. It was all over. Yep, air defense is gone, drop the balloons. <laughs> just, I just decimated. Drop my barb king in there, let him go ham little overkill there. I don't know, maybe just a little bit. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the clan is fantastic. You guys are the best. Everyone who is in the clan, you are so awesome, and I am so glad you guys are in here. Um, uh, Lou, I hope, you guys, I hope you are in the next clan war if you stay long enough, as well as you, Lucy. Lou and Lucy. Wonder if you guys know each other. If you do, that's awesome. Um, <laughs> but hopefully, uh, yeah, just it's it's gonna be great. And I'm glad you guys are in here. And everyone who uh, is going to be competing in our next clan war, I wish you guys the best of luck. And hopefully, you see this video and you get hyped for it because it's gonna be in 19 hours as of me recording this. So probably like 12. No, not 12. Maybe like 15. 14 by the time this is posted. Thank you guys for watching. This is Private Rock. I hope you enjoyed this episode of our Clan Wars recap. We will see you guys later. Have a nice day and peace out. I know you're a monster.